like I read in the National Enquirer a story about an Australian lion tamer who'd been mauled by his lion. And the, science, the sentence that I thought was really interesting and troublesome was uh, Mr. Russell, who learned lion taming through a correspondence course. <laughs> but I think a lot of that is going on right now. And of course, in the Bush White House, you know, they, 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 they made fun of fact-based reality. So, so it does worry me. I'm with you on I, I completely agree. And so at some larger level, where it, it's easy to feel like we're losing. But all of those people, and th this is what gives me hope, is, is that all of those people, when they're making purchasing decisions um, or decisions about their health, you know, so, you know, uh, my wife has a family who are very religious, uh, her cousins and aunties and uncles and, and probably are Tea Party-ish. I don't know if I should have said this because they're recording it. But because uh, they're what recording it, and, oh. and so so in, in many ways these, these are people who you know don't believe in evolution and and climate change and these things, and 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 that's fine. They're actually some of the best. They have some of the best sense of family of anyone I've ever met, and that's really lovely. But at the same time, they they have those opinions. You know, they really listen to the latest public health research, so they're making the best decisions about where to get their water from, or is this shampoo going to be more toxic or less toxic than that? And I think this is prevalent in in you know, actually, we, we, I have an 18-month-old son, and, and my wife, who is not a scientist, looks for the latest science on you know, sources of lead, sources of iron, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But at the same time... This is, this is science filtering down, and I think people are absorbed... On a daily basis, I think people are touching a lot more of these things. Whether the quality of the science that goes in all these studies is good or not is another question. But I think we are listening with hope that... what The way I think science is winning because of this is because we are slowly understanding that it is our best hope at finding the right answer. Well, first of all, these same people are rebelling against health care that would benefit them, so I'm not sure it's always true. And secondly, it makes me nervous to think in terms of winning and losing right. because it sets up what I think of as a false dichotomy, that the more we go with that either-or logic, and set things up I'm in a an reductionist. adversarial You're gonna, form. Yeah. I know. <laughs> well, that's my other issue <laughs> with science. But I think it... <laughs> but see, I'm looking to negotiate the tension between us, not to win or lose. And that's... I wish science would make more of that accommodation.